These 2018 Colorados are the Midnight and the Dusk. Midnight Special Editions have been huge hits for Silverado, Colorado, Tahoe, and Suburban. But these looks have never been available on the Colorado ZR2 until now. Both feature black grills, black accessory wheels, and black bow ties front and back. We also added a black sport bar with off-road LED lighting to illuminate the trail. Now the difference between these two trucks, the Midnight is available, of course, only in black, and the Dusk is available in any color other than black. The Dusk and the Midnight are just the latest examples of how Chevy Truck is giving our customers the kind of trucks they're looking for. Our customers love our special editions, and they're driving off lots faster than our standard trucks and conquesting new owners to Chevrolet. Now, as you can tell from its looks, the ZR2 is optimized for off-road performance. But what if you need even more off-road capabilities? Well, let's see what that truck looks like. Please welcome a member of the Desert Racing's first family, Chevy off-road racer Chad Hall and Mark Dickens back with us. Thanks, it's great to be here in the new ZR2 off-road racing truck. Now Chad, you've been spending a lot of time in the desert with this truck and with Mark's team. Yes, uh, we've done a lot of development. Um, back in August we raced uh, Vegas Torino, the longest desert race in the U.S., 500 miles. It's not a bad drive up Nevada 95. Yeah, well, we weren't on Highway 95. We were a little ways <laughs> off in the desert, uh, out there battling the ruts and rocks and sand and silt and snakes. You know, and it's important to note that your truck was the only production-based mid-sized truck to compete in and finish the race. Yes, it was uh, uh, pretty awesome. We, we beat a lot of uh, specifically built off-road race vehicles, and uh, we did it with the windows up and the AC on the whole way. That's awesome. So Mark, talk about the truck and the parts your team developed. Yeah, this truck helped prove what great platform we have with the production ZR2. The truck has great balance of desert running capabilities, rock crawling, as well as great on-road manners. So our team took the production ZR2 to the next level by developing parts that really make it truly a desert runner. So in desert running and desert racing, ground clearance and suspension capacity are key. So what we did was we actually developed a suspension that gave another inch of lift to the already lifted ZR2. We also developed a one and a half inch body lift. And then with that much suspension travel, we need to control the rear axle. So we developed a third link that actually acts as an anti-wrap link. And then of course, at the the core of the ZR2 is the Multimatic dampers. That same spool valve technology that we talked about on the race cars has been applied to dirt with a bypass. We took the production shocks and we lengthened them, and then we actually leaned on Chad here to give us some tuning advice. If we can spin it around. So for suspension capacity, we had front and rear jount shocks. These really helped with the big unexpected hits and then driveline strengthening. We went with the steel drive shaft and stronger half shafts with plunging capabilities. Stiffer tie, tie rods and high articulation angle ball joints. All this worked together to give us the suspension capacity that we needed on the truck. It's awesome. So Chad, how'd you do? Uh, did great. We took the uh, Chevy performance parts, we did a little bit of tweaking and tuning and uh, it turned out to turn our truck into a real race truck. It's great. So Mark, these are concept parts, uh, but if the reaction is strong to these, could these become production pieces we bring to market? That's always the plan, going from concept to production. It's awesome. Chad, Mark, thanks so much for bringing the truck out and for sharing the uh, information on the race wins.